silly and it's also it becomes more and more of a problem the more things get discovered Millions in Syria and Iraq are facing water shortages as the region's longest river the Euphrates dries up Joe Rogan widely celebrated for his compelling podcast sessions and sharp UFC commentaries, recently took a deep dive into the global ramifications of the Euphrates River running dry. Recognized as a fearless interviewer and a voice of reason, Rogan has ignited curiosity and concern worldwide, leading to a surge in Google searches about this crucial waterway. But what drives the importance of the Euphrates? Why should its potential drying up concern us all? Let's find out! The historical significance of the Euphrates River. The Euphrates River, stretching over 2,700 kilometers, has been a lifeline for numerous civilizations. Ancient empires such as Sumer, Assyria, and Babylon depended on its waters for survival. It was here that humanity first learned to write, build cities, and establish kingdoms. The river wasn't just a source of water, it was the birthplace of civilization itself, as we dive deeper into its history, we discover that the Euphrates was more than just a physical presence. It held a sacred place in the hearts and minds of the people. In religious texts like the Bible, the river is mentioned numerous times, often symbolizing life, prosperity, and divine blessings. For many, the Euphrates was a bridge between the earthly and the divine, a source of spiritual nourishment. But the river also played a role in conflicts and power struggles. Empires rose and fell, fighting to control this precious resource. The Euphrates was a witness to battles, alliances, and the rise and fall of kings. It saw the glory of civilizations and their eventual decline. In this way, the river became a storyteller, holding the secrets of ages past. But now, Joe Rogan reveals that the Euphrates River has finally dried up. He alarms us that those secrets will begin to emerge. Layers of silt and mud are peeling back, revealing the footprints of ancient societies. The drying riverbed is like a time capsule, waiting to share its stories with those who are willing to listen. What will we find? Lost cities? Forgotten artifacts? The answers to long-standing historical mysteries? The environmental and social impact of the river drying up? As we delve deeper into this enigmatic occurrence, we uncover the layers of impact that the Euphrates drying has cast upon the environment and the communities along its banks. This mighty river, once a pulsating vein of life, has significantly dwindled, and the repercussions are both immediate and far-reaching. First and foremost, let's discuss what led to this phenomenon. A concoction of climate change, with its relentless heat waves, coupled with extensive water extraction for agriculture, has left the Euphrates gasping for breath. Additionally, the construction of numerous dams along its course has strangled its flow, disrupting the natural balance. As the riverbed lay bare, the aquatic life that once thrived in its embrace has faced a catastrophic hit. Fish and other aquatic organisms have vanished, leaving behind a silent void. The birds that danced in the sky, drawn to the river's bounty, have taken flight to seek refuge elsewhere. According to Joe Rogan, for the communities that have, for generations, relied on the Euphrates for their livelihoods, this is a crisis of epic proportions. Farmers stare at cracked soil, once fertile and generous, now barren and unforgiving. The scarcity of water has not just wilted crops, but has sown seeds of uncertainty and despair in the hearts of the locals. But there's more. This dramatic transformation of the landscape has unveiled structures and relics from the past, whispering tales of ancient times. While this has sparked curiosity and wonder, it also poses a question, what else lies hidden beneath, and what stories do they hold? What do you think? Let us know in the comments below. Moreover, the scarcity of water has ignited concerns over the potential for conflict. Water is a vital resource, and as it dwindles, the fight to claim what's left becomes intense and potentially volatile. The communities, the countries, and the entire region stand at a crossroads, faced with the challenge of navigating these turbulent waters, both literally and figuratively. As we witness the Euphrates in its diminished state, we are reminded of the fragility of nature and the profound impact human actions have on it. The drying up of this ancient river serves as a cryptic message, urging us to reflect, reconsider, and perhaps rewrite our relationship with the natural world. 
unearthing the secrets of the Euphrates. As the Euphrates River receded, revealing a landscape unseen for millennia, archaeologists and historians worldwide turned their eyes to this ancient cradle of civilization. What was once hidden beneath flowing waters and layers of sediment began to surface, offering a tantalizing glimpse into the past. Joe Rogan shockingly states that in the now-exposed riverbed, structures that hint at long-lost cities have emerged. Some believe these could be remnants of civilizations that thrived alongside the Euphrates thousands of years ago. Each stone and artifact tells a story, waiting to be deciphered by eager minds. Could these be the remnants of settlements mentioned in ancient texts, whose locations have baffled researchers for centuries? Among the uncovered treasures are fragments of pottery, tools, and even inscriptions. These objects are like puzzle pieces, each one a crucial part of understanding the life that once flourished here. As experts meticulously study these finds, they are beginning to challenge previously held beliefs about the cultures that inhabited this region. Imagine for a moment the hands that crafted a found piece of pottery. What stories could they tell? What insights could they offer into the daily life, beliefs, and practices of ancient people? But it's not just man-made objects that have come to light. The retreating waters have also revealed a labyrinth of natural formations carved by the river over countless centuries. These geological features are providing invaluable information about the Euphrates' history, its role in shaping the landscape, and the climatic events that have influenced this region. Some areas of the dried riverbed have drawn particular attention due to unusual markings and formations. Are these the result of natural processes, or could they be evidence of ancient engineering and construction? The intrigue deepens as investigations continue, with experts from various fields joining forces to unravel the mysteries of the Euphrates. The uncovered riverbed has also brought to light a range of biodiversity previously hidden underwater, from ancient seeds and plant matter to the remains of long-gone aquatic creatures, these biological artifacts are providing a unique snapshot of the ecosystem that once thrived here. As the world watches, the Euphrates is slowly giving up its secrets, fostering a sense of wonder and curiosity. What more lies hidden beneath the remaining pockets of water and mud? What do you think? Let us know in the comments below. The Scientific Expedition and Analysis the moment news broke about the Euphrates revealing its ancient secrets, teams of scientists from around the globe flocked to the site, eager to uncover the mysteries hidden beneath the riverbed. With a rich tapestry of history dating back thousands of years, the dried-up riverbed became a treasure trove waiting to be explored. Equipped with the latest technology, these researchers embarked on a thrilling adventure into the unknown. Satellite images guided them across the vast expanse, highlighting areas that held potential for groundbreaking discoveries. Ground-penetrating radar, a tool that can see through layers of earth and rock, played a crucial role in pinpointing exact locations for further exploration. As the scientists delved deeper, they uncovered remnants of ancient civilizations, pieces of pottery, tools, and fragments of structures that once stood tall. Each discovery, meticulously excavated and documented, added a new piece to the puzzle of the past. The excitement in the air was palpable as carbon dating processes were initiated. According to Joe Rogan, this technique, capable of revealing the age of artifacts with astonishing precision, held the key to unlocking the secrets of the past. Would these remnants date back to the time of the Mesopotamian empires, or would they tell a different story, perhaps of civilizations lost to history? As days turned into weeks, the scientists worked tirelessly, their eyes filled with determination and wonder. The riverbed, dry and silent, seemed to whisper secrets of days gone by, of empires risen and fallen, of stories waiting to be told. The preliminary findings were nothing short of extraordinary. Artifacts dating back thousands of years hinted at a civilization that was advanced, sophisticated, and deeply connected to the river that flowed through its heart. But with every answer uncovered, new questions arose. What led to the downfall of this civilization? How did they live, and what beliefs did they hold? What do you think about it? Let us know in the comments below. 
The riverbed, now a canvas of history, held traces of environmental shifts and changes in climate, providing the scientists with invaluable data. This information, crucial to understanding the past, also offered insights into the present and future, especially in the face of current environmental challenges. As the expedition continued, the researchers realized they were not just uncovering history, they were unraveling a story that spanned millennia, a narrative intricately woven into the fabric of human civilization. And in the quiet of the ancient riverbed, they knew they were standing on hallowed ground, witnesses to the unfolding mystery of the Euphrates. Yet, the journey was far from over. With numerous artifacts still to be analyzed and vast areas of the riverbed yet to be explored, the scientists knew they were on the cusp of even greater discoveries. The cultural and societal reactions. The moment the Euphrates River unveiled its hidden secrets, it sent ripples across communities and continents, sparking intrigue and awe. For the locals who have lived alongside this ancient river, the transformation was nothing short of surreal. Imagine waking up to find the lifeblood of your land, a river worshipped and revered for millennia, suddenly revealing a world thought to be lost forever. In the towns and villages that dot the river's path, there was an initial wave of disbelief. Could this really be happening? As the news spread, this disbelief turned into a buzz of excitement and curiosity. Elders shared stories passed down through generations, tales of ancient civilizations and hidden treasures. The dried-up riverbed became a canvas for the imagination, a tangible link to a past shrouded in mystery. Joe Rogan also informs us how this event serves almost as a revelation for the younger generation. They grew up hearing legends of the great Euphrates, but now they were witnessing history with their own eyes. Some saw it as an adventure, an opportunity to explore and discover. Others felt a deeper connection, a sense of being part of something larger than themselves. Beyond the immediate vicinity of the river, the global community was just as captivated. Social media buzzed with pictures, theories, and discussions. Scientists and historians from around the world weighed in, offering insights and speculations. The Euphrates River was trending, and everyone wanted to be part of the conversation. Yet, amidst the excitement, there was also a sense of contemplation. The drying up of the Euphrates brought forth questions about our relationship with nature and the impact of our actions on the environment. It highlighted the fragility of our history, the delicate balance that preserves our past. In the midst of this, there were those who found spiritual significance in the event. For them, the drying up of the Euphrates was more than just a geological phenomenon. It was a sign, a message from the divine. This interpretation added another layer to the unfolding mystery, intertwining history, nature, and spirituality. The cultural fabric of the region was undeniably altered. Rituals, beliefs, and daily practices found new inspiration. Art and literature absorbed the aura of mystery, and music resonated with the echoes of a past brought back to life. As the days went by, the initial buzz subsided, but the impact lingered. The Euphrates had revealed its secrets, but it had also posed questions that demanded reflection. The riverbed, once a source of sustenance, had transformed into a source of wonder, reminding us all of the mysteries that lie beneath the surface, waiting to be uncovered. The Prophecy Fulfillment Debate As the waters of the Euphrates River receded, whispers and rumors began to circulate, connecting this astounding event to ancient prophecies found in religious texts. Many are now questioning, are we witnessing the fulfillment of prophecies foretold thousands of years ago? In various religious traditions, the Euphrates River holds profound significance. For some, it is seen as a symbolic boundary, a line between the known and the unknown, the mundane and the divine. Within the pages of the Bible, particularly in the book of Revelation, the drying up of the Euphrates is mentioned as a precursor to the end times, paving the way for kings from the east. As the once mighty river unveils its long hidden secrets, it's not just the archaeologists and historians who are paying attention. Believers around the world are watching closely, interpreting these signs through the lens of their faith. Could this be a divine message? A warning, perhaps, or a sign of things to come? The debate is heated and filled with speculation. Critics argue that linking the drying up of the Euphrates to religious prophecies is a stretch. 
They point to the clear environmental and human-made causes behind this phenomenon, emphasizing the need for practical solutions rather than mystical interpretations. On the other hand, believers see this as a moment of revelation, a tangible connection to the sacred texts they hold dear. But it's not just about prophecy. The emergence of long-lost cities and artifacts from the depths of the Euphrates has ignited imaginations and spurred debates on ancient civilizations and their connection to the present. Are there hidden messages or lessons to be learned from these relics of the past? The debate has crossed borders, inspiring discussions in living rooms, classrooms, and online forums across the globe. It's a mystery wrapped in faith, history, and the undeniable impact of environmental change. And while the waters may have receded, the waves of discussion and contemplation continue to rise. In this captivating moment of history, the Euphrates has once again proven its ability to shape our stories, beliefs, and conversations. Whether viewed through a religious, historical, or environmental lens, there's no denying the power of this event to spark curiosity, wonder, and debate. As the riverbed continues to reveal its secrets, the world watches and wonders. What will emerge next? And what does it all mean for us today? The unresolved mysteries and future prospects. According to Joe Rogan, as we delve deeper into the secrets revealed by the drying up of the Euphrates River, we find ourselves surrounded by more questions than answers. The riverbed, once teeming with life and flowing water, has uncovered remnants of the past that beg to be explored further. One of the most captivating mysteries revolves around an ancient settlement that has come to light. The intricate patterns on the pottery shards, the layout of the stone structures, and the forgotten tools left behind all tell a story. A story that we have just begun to decode. Who were the people that once called this place home? What stories did they share? And what dreams did they harbor? The answers are yet to be found as archaeologists and historians work tirelessly to piece together the fragments of a bygone era. Another enigma is the sudden disappearance of the river itself. While climate change and human activities have played a significant role, there is a sense that not all the pieces of the puzzle are in place. Could there be natural phenomena, yet to be understood, that contributed to this dramatic transformation? Scientists are on a quest, employing advanced technologies and conducting exhaustive studies to unveil the hidden factors that led to the river's demise. As we ponder these mysteries, there is a glimmer of hope and a surge of excitement for what the future holds. The dried-up riverbed is now a treasure trove for researchers, offering a unique opportunity to study the Earth's past and gain insights that were once submerged underwater. The findings from this research could reshape our understanding of history, geography, and the environment. And yet, amidst this scientific fervor, there is a sense of urgency. The region that once thrived on the Euphrates is now faced with new challenges. The absence of the river's waters has left a void, affecting livelihoods, ecosystems, and the very fabric of local communities. There is a call to action, a need to address these challenges head-on and work collaboratively to ensure a sustainable future for the region. In these times of change and discovery, the Euphrates River, even in its absence, continues to be a source of intrigue, inspiration, and insight. As we stand at the crossroads of the past and the future, the dried-up riverbed serves as a stark reminder of nature's power and the enduring mystery of our world. The journey of exploration is far from over, and the stories that will emerge are sure to captivate the imaginations of generations to come. Friends, thanks for exploring with us on Beyond Discovery. If you enjoyed these revelations, click now on the next video that pops up on your screen. It's unbelievable.